Today Location Location Properties introduced to the market number 30 Lenina, Gart Road, Ennis County Clare. This four bedroom detached dwelling which was constructed in the early 1990s by Hegarty Construction. It's block built with tiled roof and um, it's a house that has been very much updated over the years here. It's in the uh, lovely mature estate of Lenina which is a high percentage of owner occupier. As you can see an extremely well looked after area. Located in a nice quiet cul-de-sac within the remit of the development. As you can see here, we have the nice definition of having your own driveway. and um, Parking here for definitely up on two vehicles with the potential to extend to more if required. We're on all main services here going from sewer to water to electric and broadband. This is a four bedroom dwelling as stated. With three en suites. And these on suites and the main bathroom have been updated in very recent past so they're very modern garage here which is a lovely option to have on board as well so we have um, a ceiling hatch inside there we'll have a look at it in a moment which gives access up into that upper area paths leading all the way around would we'll say the property itself orientation here is east west going from east to the rear of the dwelling in the morning to west in the afternoon and the evening Again, ease of access to all the amenities Ennis has to offer, going from, uh, would say, what you're about 1.3 kilometres to the town centre itself. You have Lidl, Aldi, Tesco's, Dunn's, primary, secondary schools, pedestrian crossings, all within close proximity. So we'll now proceed to the interior. Upon entering here, you can see that we have the uh, wood grain PVC windows, uh, which are double glazed. Great job here. We have the porch area done, which was a fantastic idea here, while still offering plenty of natural light into the entrance. Uh, it takes away any draft elements, we'll say, that would have been here beforehand. So we have a solid teak front door with frosted glass panelling, laminate wood flooring, and we have our carpeted stairs leading to the first floor area. Through to the garage here, which we'll have a look at now in a few moments. That's a fire door. We have our understair storage. Just here to our right hand side. Through to our sitting room. This is a very well presented and well proportioned layout of the dwelling. So lovely and clean. We have our oil fire central heating is our main heat source to the property here. Uh, which is set with thermostats uh, going throughout with say, each of the radiators. Um, it's a condenser oil boiler, um, which would be very efficient. Uh, we also have the back boiler here in the open fireplace, which is a circulating pump in situ there, so you'll never be stuck. Media points there as well. Fibre broadband, which is essential in the day and age that we live in. Through to our kitchen dining area here, which is fine space here. Uh, we have our wood grain tile flooring. As you can see the thermostat there in the radiator as we approach inwards. Uh, lovely oak kitchen units here with Formica worktops, stainless steel sink, hot cold, PVC door leading to the rear garden space, subway tiling, ample storage here, both in the under counter units and the eye level units here. A little bit of thought went into design, very functional. Extractor fan there going up and out to the exterior. So into this space here is the utility room, which is tiled, floor to ceiling. So very easy to maintain. We have our spaces here for washing machine and dryer, fluorescent lighting, and good cupboard space here as well, which is never any harm to see. So all that shipping for the general cleaning tidbits that would be, I suppose, associated with a space like same. View of our back garden there, banking onto the primary school, which is located out to the rear. As you can see, we have a lovely patio area, lawn area, side gate access going out to that. So we're not overlooked in any way, shape, or form. So whatever development is done and completed, let's say within the limit of the immediate area. So now going to our downstairs bedroom, which is on suite, generous bedroom space here. Could be used as bedroom, playroom, office. All of the above, gym or whatever you require. But it's extremely well finished here, as you can see by the uh, ensuite. 
nice neutral tones here. We've got strip light mirror, electric vent going on there. We have our shower space in through here as well, which we have the electric shower in situ. Little shelves there, so very well presented. Again, we've got chrome and glass shower door in situ there. So we'll now proceed to the garage. So we get a little look at where we're coming from the kitchen to the entrance hallway. So we have our garage here, the partition, the far side of that is the utility. Here's the ceiling hatch I was talking about a few moments ago where there's definite potential to go up above this space as well. We have our roller doors uh, here, so concrete flooring, we have our lighting. Space could be maintained as is or incorporated into what will be the footprint of the house in a living space capacity. So now to our first floor. So on our first floor area here we have our lovely landing window which throws plenty of light into the immediate space here. Get an overview of what we've come up there, just been our stair, our hot press here which is immersion heated as well as being heated by the bank boiler and the oil fire central heating for heating of hot water. So here we have our main bathroom, which is super space. All newly tiled, tanked, finished out, no stray pipes hanging out around here. All very modern, no timber window boards or anything like that. Very much a bath space here. You do have the mixer shower head on the taps there. But with the amount of ensuite that's in situ, it leaves it as a space strictly, I suppose, for maybe kiddies or somebody who very much desires having their bath instead of a shower. So here we have bedroom uh, number two here, which again is en suite. We have our solid pine flooring. We have our fitted wardrobes here as well. So good storage capacity. And we get an overview of our back garden again here, which is lovely. And again, the primary school out to the rear. Again, an overview just to take a quick look at the quality of the finish inside in the ensuite area. You can hear our vent going in the background there as well. Don't need to be seeing me. And we have our shower here, which is an electric pump shower. So all nice neutral tiling. We have a wall mounted heater there as well. And as you can hear, the extractor fan there fully functional. This will be kind of classified as the main bedroom. Again, your solid timber flooring, good, generous double bedroom space, TV points, double sockets located throughout here. Again, nice overview of what's going out to the front here. All very pleasant. There's a walkway going straight out through that fire wall there as well, so you don't have to walk all the way out through the estate. Again, our ensuite through here. Lovely, fresh, clean, well maintained. All piping, wiring, and so on is very modern, we'll say, in this property. Electric shower inside here, strip light, mirror, WC, washing and basin, tile flooring. So that's our property here at number 30, Glenina, Gort Road, Ennis, County Clare. For further details, you can contact our offices at locationlocation.ie by way of phone number of 065-672-9999 or by way of email at info at locationlocation.ie and also keep an eye on uh, daft or equivalent websites um, to see when open viewings are taking place. Many thanks.